Every year, on May 17th, IOM commemorates the International Day Against Homophobia, Biphobia, Intersexphobia and Transphobia. As the leading international organization in the field of migration, IOM works with migrants with diverse sexual orientation, gender identity, gender expression and sex characteristics all around the world. We stand against the continued discrimination and violence faced by lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, intersex and queer or LGBTYQ plus people. This year theme, our bodies, our lives, our rights, draws attention to the fact that globally LGBTIQ plus uh, people continue to be denied bodily autonomy and access to fundamental human rights. To this day, people with diverse sexual orientations and gender expressions continue to be targeted, persecuted and detained as well as denied access to dignified health care, social services and participation in society. This forces many to leave their homes, often embarking on dangerous journeys to live better and safer lives. We also observe with concern that around the world intersex infants are still routinely subjected to non-consensual, irreversible, non-medically necessary surgeries, despite the UN stating that such interventions may constitute torture. In wars and uh, conflict zones, LGBTIQ plus migrants and uh, crisis-affected populations remain even more vulnerable and at risk on their journeys to escape violence and in their transit or destination countries. At IOM, we are committed to treat everyone we assist with dignity and respect. We endeavor to provide safety and protection for LGBTIQ plus migrants in our offices and programs. IOM is enriched by our diversity and by the work of all our LGBTIQ plus staff across the globe. They make a difference in our offices and in the lives of vulnerable communities. Today, I reaffirm IOM's commitment to protect LGBTIQ plus migrants and combat discrimination and violence against all people. I am an LGBTIQ plus ally and I stand for human rights for all.